local residents are still being exposed to dangerously high levels of radiation nearly 30 years after an explosion at a nuclear power plant in Ukraine. That's according to the head of the Greenpeace Russia energy program. Today, in the regions where these people live, the rate of disease is higher. For children, this rate is roughly twice as high as in the so-called clean places. Here, we also have a higher rate of breast cancer. And we should not forget the people who took part in the liquidation of the Chernobyl catastrophe. The Chernobyl nuclear power plant exploded in April 1986, sending a plume of radioactive fallout across large areas of Europe. A research report published on Wednesday said in some cases radiation levels in the contaminated zones where an estimated 5 million people live have actually increased. According to Greenpeace, local foods containing radioactive particles can be found in Ukraine, Russia and Belarus, the three countries nearest to the catastrophe site. People still have contact with radiation. They get exposed to radiation through food. Greenpeace gathered samples of milk, mushrooms and berries that people eat and found that the majority of the samples in Ukraine have abnormally high proportions of radiation. The situation is almost the same in the Bryansk region of the Russian Federation. Long-term exposure to radiation can lead to several illnesses. Doctors in the areas worst affected by Chernobyl have long reported of a sharp rise in certain cancer rates.